What's up guys? Today is Monday. That means it's Joe's All-Star Tool Monday. We're on Joe's truck, so let's take a look and see what he's got. So you guys, come on. Hey guys, how you doing? Um, first things first. My wife's getting better every week. Appreciate all the good comments, all the prayers, all the kind thoughts. Um, really, that's the first thing on my mind. Um, I talk about me. I've had a second surgery. I can almost see you back through this camera because <laughs> I was told this camera could see if I got something hanging out of my nose. So hopefully I don't have anything hanging out of my nose. This um, is the first time we've got to shoot your truck with, with this camera. With the new camera. Right. So what a great day. Um, we're going to start with the bucket of cash just because um, we got it here. Look at that. So, we're going to start with Mr. Charlie Bell. See, we got you first here. It's got your name on it, not mine. Mr. Charlie Bell, you're in. We have Mr. Al in my hand. We got you in. And we have Mr. Timothy Austin. We have you in for two. Two. Big spender. What a great day. There we go. And that will pack down. Now, on the day, the morning when I was going in for my surgery, I had a few guys call, call text me, you know, hey, uh, can you send me this? Hey, can you send me that? And I said, yes, indeed, uh, but it'll be like tomorrow, the next day. But all them guys got a surprise later because everybody that texted me that day, I covered the shipping. Ooh, now, I don't do that, but, but I did. It wasn't much on a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff, it was small, little, you know. These here been been very good. These uh, little baby cobra pliers. Yeah. I've been... Sending a bunch of them all over the place. So, yep, them now, things are awesome. To tell you the truth, whether I shipped them all that Thursday or some Friday because I ran out of time, it, all the people that contacted me for everything that Thursday got free shipping. So, oh, it didn't matter what it was, I covered it. I was in a good mood. I was getting my second eyesight <laughs> back. And I'm telling you, uh, the very next day, yeah, I had. 2020 i was seeing when's the last time you had 2020 vision you know i really don't know to tell you I, it's just like you know when did it, you start really gaining weight before you know i was pushing these buttons way on out here <laughs> and, you know spreading them apart and yeah um so how much did i lose 78 pounds wow that's a big number that's like a little kid you know yeah. i got grandkids that don't weigh that much but uh <laughs> You know, it's That's easier. That's awesome. It's a big number. Um, yeah, I got new clothes. I got, I, I, I'm waiting for my wife to get to where she wants to be to before I start wearing You're getting them. to that bikini weight for next summer, ain't you? Oh, well, you know, the bikini wax. No, you didn't say that. Bikini, my hearing's not Bikini right weight. There. Bikini weight. No. Uh, Joe will be on Miami in a Speedo next summer wearing a pink thong. It says Joe's All-Star Tool across the front. There's not enough across the letters front. on top for all that. <laughs> but no, no. Um, anyways, I know we were talking about tools somewhere here. So we have a couple things. We have cool box. Easy red. Easy uh -oh. red. Ooh, even I see something different from last time I had these. New handles. New handles. Quarter, three-eighths, half-inch, but... What's cool with these, and the Easy Red, they're small, compact, tight places when you need it. But when you need more, yep. they expand, they extend. Mm -hmm. So you just got a hook all the locks connect. out. Yeah. So compact, tight when you need it, they extend out. They extend out when you need more leverage. They're nice and tight in a tight area. Yep. That's the quarter, three-eighths, and half-inch set. We got the three-eighths. It's 
Starts here, gets wow. a bit longer. Now, it's not your longest 3 8s, mm -hmm. but it's a good size. And DZ Red keeps lifetime warranty on it. Cool. So they break it? They bring you, it back you to find Joe? A way, and... You find a way to uh, use, use, abuse, and destroy it to your heart's content, and I'll, find, I'll replace it. Can't beat that. And then here's the half inch. And it's heavy. I mean, it's solid. Just get, just feel that. Yep. It's solid. That's a nice ratchet. And it gets out there. I mm -hmm. mean, that's a good size half inch. And in a tight spot, it's there. Or, oops, this one's got two. Didn't you have four. like a big three-quarter ratchet? I had a big three-quarter easy had a big red. One. Yeah. And that's in some. Uh, big trucking place and uh, I can't tell you when I uh, warranted one of them but cool. I got them in heavy duty places all over. They hold up. They are very good. Awesome. Matter of fact I had a guy asking about these specifically because I had them before mm -hmm. but I don't think we did them on the show. Easy Red we got them for what we got them for if I could see where I left my list but uh, Hundred bucks. Hundred dollars for three ratchets. Hundred smack roonies. We have here, because somebody wanted to get them. I got uh, it's A to Z punches. It's zero to nine. So numbers and letters. You'll have to tell everybody what happened with that. Oh yeah, I was, we were opening it. It was like this here. I pull it out. I cut the tape. I go open it up. I'm not doing that this way again, but. Uh, See what All happened? of them hit the now, floor. Now, if we look, and if you take time to freeze frame in that, they are not in order no more. No. Because we did the... Uh, the reason why you did that, though, and that way whoever buys them can have an alphabet refresher course. Yeah. And as you see, the end you hit on, they even flame hardened, so you're not going to smash and bash it all over right away. Mm-hmm. So it's tempered and it should all be hardened, but the uh, end use smash and bash is tempered. So before I do uh, return this to the guy, I may find out if I know my alphabet and numbers <laughs> once again. Don't get the zero just, and just, the O mixed up. Just, just because I do that. Just like when I get people, uh, their Milwaukee kits, as long as I'm not shipping them somewhere. I make sure they got a full charge, they're ready to play. Matter of fact, I'm going to do what they didn't do. I'm going to show the number side up when you open it. There you go. Oh yeah, I see the difference too. When you look at the other side, it's numbers down on this side, mm. numbers up on that side. But I did, I did see what... Even I did figure the, it out. Dude. Even the tool guy gets excited with new tools. Hey, you know. We have fun with this stuff. And we have... How long you been selling tools, Joe? Since the very beginning, how long has it been? Over 15 years, 16 mm. years, a couple of days, you know, last week, two hours, this morning. <laughs> um, You're probably the only tool truck guy that ever drag raced his tool truck, too. Well, no, there were a few of us, but uh, let me see. Was it all Cornwell I, guys? We were. Yeah. But I don't think there's, I think I might, I'd have to check, but I may be one of the only ones out of that group that's still a tool guy. A couple of them guys have retired, a couple of guys uh, just quit, a couple of them got booted. But the Slimhead Design 90T 3.8 kit. Yep. So I had guys like this. So, but I had a couple guys say, "I want a quarter inch little baby, mm -hmm. baby one." So, well, they're both quarter inch heads. I I, I called, so. and yes, they make a little quarter inch slim head. It's even slimmer than the uh, three eighths one. Mm -hmm. Ninety two, it's fine. It's there. I mean, you can hear it. Can you? It's there. It's fine. Nice handle, nice grip, and we have them for a whole. This, you know, I can never read these before, but I do need a little better light. <laughs> I'm just making sure those numbers right. 
38 bucks. 38 bucks. 38 bucks for a little quarter inch, there 90 teeth. Cool deal. So it's a slim head design. Hope you guys all have a great week ahead. So if oh. anybody's got cataracts or eye problems, you highly recommend the surgery then, huh? You, oh man, I'm telling you, the very next day I could see 2020. Um, yeah, and every day it gets better. Um, yeah. Well uh, worth I, the money. Uh, yeah. And if you're anywhere in uh, West Tennessee, North Mississippi, anywhere, Hughes uh, Eye Group, they take care They're of you. They're in Jackson, Tennessee? Yes. Uh, cool. They take good care of you. Matter of fact, I did my surgery in Lexington, t Tennessee, but I got to go up to Jackson for my checkups and stuff. But they take very good care of you. And, uh, well, it seems I, to be working because you've always had to put your glasses on to read man, the tickets. I'm telling so. you, it's, I'm liking it more and more. That's Every day, awesome. They, they tell me next couple weeks is just going to keep getting better. I go, it's 2020, but... Um, when I was there the next day, I says, well, what are we going to need? What am I going to need for readers? He says, well, here, just try these. And he just grabbed something that was one and a half. It's like, it's like, <laughs> I, I go, does it hurt you if you get, you know, like stronger than you really need? Does that, that hurt your eyes? He says, the only thing that hurts your eyes is when you poke, poke something in them like your finger. And I go like spoons, knives, and forks. He says, yeah, that hurts even more. Yeah. So. That's cool. So uh, if a guy's wondering, thinking, hey, I may need some reading glasses, and he gets them a little too strong, it's, it's not going to hurt It's not going to hurt, not going to affect. He says, uh, get what, what you feel comfortable with reading. See, my understanding was if you get the wrong kind, I always thought it damaged your eyes, but I've apparently heard not. I've heard people say that, too, and I asked them that. So that's why I asked them. I says, sometimes uh -huh. I read some pretty small numbers. He says, well, just find out, you know. When you're in the store, you just read the back of a label or something. If you can't read it, get something that, that you read cool. it fine with. So, well, so, he knows what he's talking about. That's what he does. So. That's good. Um, so, if you need anything, I will ship to you. Uh, don't matter where you're at, I'll ship to you. Across the pond, across the border, across the U.S. Oh, we did get wet this weekend. You know, plenty of rain. Don't worry about it. We, we got wet. I just mm. wish... Some of them fires could have got some of that rain we got. Yeah. Uh, it would have done you a lot of good out there. That's but, true. So, well, thumbs up, hit the button, subscribe, phone number. There you go. Joe's told you what to do. If you want anything, his phone number is 731-412-7295. Yes, I've had that memorized for years. <laughs> I know, <laughs> but I like it when you say it because when I say it, nobody seems to hear it. So. Once again, 731-412-7295. Text Joe if you see anything you want on the truck, and he will ship it to you. It don't matter if they're in England, Ireland, Iceland. Who cares, right? As long Tim as Buck, I, too. As long we, as I got a like credit Tim card Buck and too. willing to pay the shipping. We got it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Like always, if you like the video, hit that thumbs up. Cool tools, discount codes, merchandise, and just click that subscribe button. If you're not subscribed, it don't cost you nothing. Click it. Free. Just hit it. All right, guys. Y'all have a great yeah. week, and we will catch y'all next time. See ya.